waiting. You're live! Hello, everybody! Welcome back to Saturday Night Survival. Sorry about that. YouTube was having some struggles uh, connecting to OBS. So, but we're here. And we are live. And hopefully... Hopefully... We are not having any more of those, uh... Those sound glitches or anything. So, um... Hello, stream. Hello, Jexum. Hello, Jeffrey Thomas, Alchemy, Scarlet. Nice to see all of you here. And nice to see all of you here in stream today. We are joined by 13 Red Spear for the first time. Hello, 13 Red Spear. Hello. We are, uh, we returned for a long time. Uh, C. Kerman, who hitchhiked his way from uh, the Martian world over to here. How's it going, Kermit? It's going okay. Although I can say I do not particularly like your choice of paint job. <laughs> uh, yeah, well, I like the wood. So, uh, Floki, who, uh, this name here, is pronounced Floki. <laughs> and then we are joined by Alchemy. Oh, his mic is muted. Jure. Hello. And Huaco. Hello. And of Waco, course. Waco, Waco. <laughs> and of course, Creator. Okay, so now that most of the introduction is out of the way, you will notice tonight that the nab cam is off and Nabarine isn't here. She has. Uh, she had an engagement she had to go to tonight and she hopefully will be joining us later in the stream. But for now, it's just us boys. So we'll see if we can stay out of trouble. Um, so today, we have a problem. We need to get to that satellite. And to do that, we need to get into space. We had a shuttle. Um, the Reavers did not care for our shuttle, and so they killed us all. And now we're back on the planet. My thought is we will send a team back via backspace teleport to start building some hydrogen, some small grid hydrogen freighters get to the lake, start filling those up, uh, and then we will stay here, grind down all the resources we have here, then drive as close to the lake as possible, and then we will, uh, we will have you guys come and fill everything up, and then we'll lift off. We'll convert to a, a, a ship, and we will take this bad boy into orbit. So, any questions? I would suggest a jump drive. Yeah, that's probably a good plan. I think we can build one. We did have some uh, superconductors that we were able to grab. Um, but yeah, we've got a lot of work to do. So do I have... Uh, let's see. Let's get four volunteers to go back and do the uh, do the hydrogen freighters. Uh, okay. Uh, I uh, made sure. myself. Okay. That's a so, good help out. I'm Kermin, not for anything. Crew. Um, Floki, you can head along, and then Alchemy, you want to head over there too? Just kind of keep uh, them all in I line. Oh, Red Spear, was that you? Yeah. yeah, Okay. that was me. Sorry, I think I'm kind of quiet. I don't know how to fix it. Uh, here, I'll just boost you a little bit. Uh, there we go. I should be able to hear you a little more. Okay, so Red Spear, Crew, Kerman, and Floki, head on over. Just go ahead. We'll, uh, I'll turn off the med bay over here, and you guys can just backspace teleport. What so, are we gonna use? The city? Yeah, whatever you can uh, find in the city. Well, there should be some resources yeah. there in the uh, in the the old base, and I'm just gonna go ahead and help crew on his way. He's still trying to connect. Um, what I think I am going to ask you guys to do so you can talk about things is I'll have you guys pop into a different channel until it's time for the uh, the actual linking up. And you guys can just, you know, if you need to talk to us, just come on in and pop in and uh, ask any questions you need to ask. But just to keep the crosstalk to a minimum, because I know it's really hard to design a ship without talking to people. So, um, So, on your way. And then the rest of us, let's uh, let's step out here, and let's start grinding down this, and then we'll 
Uh, shut the door behind you. There we go. Uh, game one looks like a good play. Yep, that'd be great. Oh, and uh, everyone close your eyes because I totally forgot when I was setting up to uh, bring the sun back to its normal spot. So, oh man, oh, that was a good night's sleep. All right. Yes. It's still really dark here. Wonderful. Oh, you need me to lift the sun a little bit more? I'll lift it just a little bit more. There you go. All right. Let's see. John Preacher, hello. Matt, hello. And Eddie, hello. I'm glad, Jackson, that you like the wood paneling. I'm also especially proud of the uh, the disco here on the tires. I mean, it's definitely, uh, definitely a feature. Uh, but that that whole that whole thing, uh, it's deuglifying, was Scarlet all the way. He spent a, a good long time trying to get that thing looking good. Let's see, yeah. oh right, no jetpacks. Uh, I've been playing on a different world. <laughs> Here, how's everybody's day going? Pretty good. Pretty good. Played some Planet Side 2, killed some enemies, got killed. I can't get anything for this connector to the card thing. Which connector? The bottom one. Interesting. You should be able to. It's pipe. Oh, wait. Uh, I may not have turned on the survival kit again. Which, will, which I think will cut it out. Let me go turn that on. I just did. Okay. It's and still then... not working. Huh. Let's see. Well, something's broken. You wanna go troubleshoot that, Alchemy? Yeah. Alright, thank you. Okay, John Preacher says thanks for the great vids. Can't wait to see more. Well, John, I really appreciate that, and uh, we are writing season three of Deadly Salvage. And in the meantime, every Tuesday we will come out with a gameplay video of some kind. We uh, we definitely enjoy uh, people's. I thought we were supposed to have one more person in the uh, action build group, and we don't. Oh, uh, Huaco, did you go over there with them? No. I thought it was... It was Kerman? Well, the crew just disappeared. Oh, is crew gone? Okay, so we'll we, we, we may have lost... We, a, we three can work. Yeah, we may have yeah. lost crew. He may have lost internet. He That happens to him sometimes. Okay. Well, you guys... Okay. Uh, I, I'm, I, I, I have trust in your engineering skills, guys. Don't let me down. The five. There we go. Oops. Drop that. Okay. Let's see. Head on down here. Let's see what I got here. Checks chat again. Greg Ivy says, excited first night watching you guys. Discovered you two weeks ago. I've been binge watching to catch up. Well, Greg, I am glad that you enjoy our content. We, we've been kind of blown away. I mean, so a lot of you, uh, a lot of you guys who are new to the, to the stream, uh, uh we, we are running into a problem. Yes. Okay. Uh, we have no pro Oh, progression. Oh, let me fix that. Let me fix that. Sorry. There you go, I should do it. Alright. But, uh, yeah, so we got... We, we really got blindsided by Keen Software House sharing our series on all of their social media and uh, the channel growth has been kind of insane uh, really really humbling honestly 
and we're so grateful to all of you who have recently discovered us and have subscribed to us and have left all sorts of feedback that we've it's just it's blown us away guys so thank you so much and crew in chat says it looks like he needs to restart his computer again so we'll see hopefully he'll he's able to get it running if not well them's them's the digs sometimes put all those in there I think we've gotten most of the good bits from down here I think there's some stuff on top the whirly bits up top might have something good in them So if anyone's wondering um, why we keep running up and down the scaffolding, jetpacks don't work in this world. I mean, they do, but only in space and very weakly. They're more like what you would see uh, NASA using. They can use just a little bit. Alchemy, are you trying to grind that down? Yes. Uh... Be careful, there's a lot of stuff in there that's all fucking I'm out. pretty sure... What is it connected to? the refinery? Yeah, it's the refinery. Okay. Yeah, I, can, I don't have my welder on me. Well. <laughs> I'll get you a welder, I guess. Or you can go grab one. Ah. Oh. Fun. Fun, fun, fun. Alright. Um, I think I'm actually going to turn the music up a little bit because it seems like it's a little uh, I know on the wrong side. I figured out what's wrong. Is the refinery off? No, oh, the one of the connect cargo containers was ground down for some reason. That's not the reason I ground that down. Oh. Trying to figure this out. Oh, there's a decoy here. Nice. Might actually just use the decoy. We do not have shields. Um, but yeah, so if anyone... I'm going to do a little quick recap for those people watching. So right now, uh, this world... This is sort of a quasi roleplay that we've been doing through here. And we are on a world called Mara. And we got here... Uh, we crash landed here after flying through sublight... Uh, from a, a Martian type world where we encountered a bunch of aliens called the Formic and they want to eat people they see us as a source of food and nothing else and they chased us we were quite well established doing pretty well and they chased us completely off their planet and killed many of us and destroyed everything we had except for we actually had escaped in one of their ships that we had captured Oh, they're incoming decoy. Um, so that that's oh no, okay, I didn't fall as far as I thought I was going to, but so that, that's what happened there. And we got here, we woke up to find out that the Formic have already been here, and they harvested everyone and they left some of the stuff behind. And we need to get up to a FTL satellite and talk to the rest of our star nation, the United Space of America, and tell them what's going on, warn them about the Formic, and hopefully uh, get some help out here, get some pickup. But that's why we're grinding the sounds, why we got to get to space, because up there, way out, 410 satellite location, 410 kilometers away, that's where we need to get to go, and try and repair that satellite, or recover that satellite, and then... Uh, get everything going from there. <laughs> Why would I do something like that with the jetpack, Scarlet? Uh, because I am a bad person. How's the troubleshooting going with the, uh, the cargo system, guys? I have Out. no progress so far. Yes, that's what I love to hear. Sounds like a Space Engineer series to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I do love this game, though. 
this, uh, I don't know, it's weird. I've, I was never interested in Minecraft or anything, and then I was like, eh. I, I was really into Kerbal Space Program, and I kept seeing ads for this game, and I was like, ah, eh, well, I'll give it a shot. And lo and behold, here I am, like, 1700 hours later. And I know some of you in the audience probably have, like, three or four thousand hours, but... Okay, I think it's working now. Cool. Great job, guys. Master Scarlet, you'll be the <laughs> obvious question asker. I really hope we don't need to take this scaffolding down. Uh, well, I mean, the scaffolding will come down pretty easy. Just hit BB yeah. on it. Say so what? I said just hit BB on it. Oh, only after he's frustrated. So, yeah, that's why that tower over there doesn't have a top anymore and why it's sitting... I believe it's sitting right there. Yeah, that's the top of it. Uh, after we got brutalized up in space, BB took all of his negative emotions out on that poor tower over there. All right. Oh. All right. Grab some of this stuff here. It's a good thing all this, uh... Oh, my energy's low. It's a good thing this tower is camouflaged so well. I mean, people might see it otherwise. Yes, can't have that happen. Shroud in Discord says, The music seemed appropriate for the engineers jumping around under the connector. I love moments like that. Uh, yeah, Jexum. Uh, it's... It is... Much more... I think it's more on the side of Minecraft than Sim. But uh, the physics in it are... Make it challenging enough to play. That, oh, that's gotta come out. And then we'll put it on this side, I think. I'll let Huaco do it. It's one point where we can Give me a platform there. I'll get this thing ground down. Oh, inventory full right away. Gotta love those large steel tubes. Was there anything on top of this you wanted? I think there's some stuff up there. I don't know. I don't know what it is. I mean, well, I mean, I do. I do know what's up there. Well, it's been a long time since I built this, but, uh, yeah, sorry to break the magic, guys. I built, I built a lot of the set pieces in here. Scarlet actually helped me with this one. He's a excellent griebler. I think we should be able to cut through the top there. There we go. That's what we do. Yes, we cut through the wall and steal the goodies on the other side. Ooh, rotary stuff. Spinny bits, lots of solar panels. Ooh, perfect for planning them out. Grab some scaffolding uh, supplies here. Remote controls too. Artemis, is that you? <laughs> I'm sorry Make about that. I'm sorry, engineer. I'm not Artemis. Yeah, and uh, just so everybody knows, the uh, we do have anytime there's a, a one of those stream interaction chats across, you know, either from a subscription or a, a donation or anything. It is Artemis's voice that comes up. We made sure of that. Um. So if you wanna wanna hear her voice, get one of your friends to subscribe. <laughs> yeah, and and Jackson, another thing I've noticed, like, Space Engineers is really cool because it like 
It's oh, it's going over. Goodbye. <laughs> Timber. <laughs> Wait, was that Timber? That was on to the rover, guys. Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> oh. Oh. Did we lose anything important? Other than uh, the big gun? Just the big gun. Just the guns up top. Well, nothing. Uh, I thought it was going over the other way. I was trying to cut it out from the outside. I thought the same. Baco, did, did, you, did you cut it off? Yeah, what? I thought it was on the Baco. other side. Ow. Baco, you need to. Sp Sorry. I think you need to spend. You're gonna have to spend five minutes in the bunk. You're you're confined to your bunk for the next five minutes. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> All right, that's uh. I think it would be a better use of my time if I start repairing the roof. Yeah. I, okay. Yeah. I'll go, no, to go ahead. Go ahead and start <laughs> fixing the roof. Do you have the DLC? I don't have the DLC for these games, but I can play Splot on someone else paints. Uh, I'll just have to take control uh, of the rover. Oh, it broke the name too. Oh, oh, that's ugly. Oh, we lost a couple of beds and everything. Hopefully, nobody was in them. <laughs> Scarlet says, "My cannons, you monster!" <laughs> and Scarlet. Shroud Sorry. says, "That's why you cut the notch in the tree away from anything you want intact." <laughs> you know what? I kind of like the skylight. <laughs> oh man, we lost. Uh... So this connected right here. So we'll... I think it was G. Tank. Putting some of this stuff back. Put another one there just in case. And then G conveyors. Oh boy. All right. <laughs> Well, it's, uh, definitely a build stream. <laughs> well, goodbye, all these templates we won. Well, we got oh, a lot no. of, uh, scrap metal, so... We'll be able to make them up bigger. Convertible rover may not be airtight, says, says Eddie Magpie. <laughs> <laughs> But it's a convertible, man. I mean, you know, this is a this is a feature. <laughs> oh man. Hey crew, say goodbye to your bed. Oh, his bed. We can we can put the beds back. I mean, uh... one of the airlock doors has been broke. Uh, well, it's okay. We don't need an airlock anymore right now. Oh, that's backwards. Yeah, it's all these fucking turns. <laughs> Get those in there. Oh, man. Oh. Did we lose Scarlet in that? Add him to the death counter? Oh, no. Uh, and remember, guys, if you don't know what the rover looked like before, we do have a blueprint just floating here in the middle of the air. Okay, How come so... Can you not, like, box me in? <laughs> okay. Yes. This is an approved way of welding. I'm sure OSHA would be fine with this. What well, OSHA don't know won't hurt. <laughs> Let's see, yeah, I'm just grab some steel plates real quick here. 
Go this way here. Go this way. There we go. You know, I was even talking to myself a little bit before the stream, like, okay, I just gotta make sure that we don't accidentally drop anything on the rover, because it'll just be bad. It'll, you know, can't, don't do that, because it'll you didn't cause a lot make of extra it. work. We, uh, we did it. We dropped it right on. Your plans were not joke proof <laughs> We also had like three people grinding. Somebody might, we all might have contributed to. Yeah, a little bit. I was just trying to cut away the outside, and then all of a sudden it started going over. I'm like, oh, this will be cool to watch. And then I was like, wait a minute, I think that's where we parked. And sure enough. <laughs> all right, the tanks are back in. Let's see. Was it really a double layer of armor up top? Oh, I need to need to charge up. The OSHA out, out space outer space safety and health administration. Yes, exactly. Wow, I just died. <laughs> right on I target, Greg. Update the death counter. <laughs> All right. Okay. Do we have the resources to remake the big gun? Uh, let's not worry about that right now. We didn't even, I don't think we even had ammo for it anyway. Yeah, we had none. Plus I'd rather have like a real gun or something better. Yeah. Why have big gun if big gun cannot be? Shroud in Discord says, No plan survives 10 seconds contact with space engineers. <laughs> the door. There we go. Wow, 14 viewers this early in the stream. Oh. <laughs> okay. The outside of the rover looks normal again. I don't even know what that is. I didn't even know we had that. I think this was... Did this just end right here like this? Oh, I see it goes around. Okay. I got this. Well, the roof is now flat. I'm yep. sure we can make some shape. Go ahead and start like grinding it. everything else down. Oh, I just fell off. Nice. I don't know how that happened, but I'll take it. Back up there. Oh yeah, I forgot I built this on the last one. Alright, everything 
engineer. We oh. are being followed. We are <coughs> being followed. Andrew Galloway just subscribed. Thank you, Andrew. Appreciate it. Maybe it's not a problem with the piping. I still can't access any of the other cargo containers from the bottom. You must have a sinking issue because it worked fine for me. Try reconnecting. Getting our letters back. I'm spelling it correctly this time without the one. Hearing some clanging. This thing is flipping over. Oh, okay. Uh, did the world close? Say what? World close? No, it's still running. No. Still running. Oh. My game is paused over here. Uh, try reconnecting. Or you might have to restart your Space Engineers client. I've been noticing a lot more multiplayer issues since the economy update has come out. Which is unfortunate. Because I think the economy updates are really, uh, it's a really good addition to the game. It's something, you know, had something else to do other than just kill pirate ships and build. But, uh, yeah, things, things are definitely getting a little buggier as of, as of late. <laughs> yeah, Schoon no longer is back to Scorpion. See, we, Scarlet, we, uh, we just disassembled the, the gun. We just disassembled the gun and, uh, when we dropped it, it just it fell right over it and missed it completely. It's, it's nothing to worry about. Hmm. So the survival kit is not activated right now. Survival kit's not on. Nope. All right, let's turn that back on. It should be. There's one glitter plate on the bottom of this. Well, it's not. I'm back in at the uh, okay, canyon. Let me, turn, let me turn it on. I don't know what's going on there. Oh, that was weird. There it is. Yeah, it's off. Back on now. There should be a timer over there. Some stuff on here. Our nice wooden survival kit. And our glitter reactor. Equipment made from only the finest materials. Yes. Metal metal fiber wood. Scarlet, we're not terrible people. We didn't design the Formix, okay? By the way, guys, uh, if any of you in stream have ever... I don't know if you guys have watched the last one, but the Formix that I described uh, inspired Lucas to make the Formic Invasion mod. And if you've never played with that, um, you'll understand Go why ahead. I say Scarlet is an evil person. If you value your builds, don't. Oh, we just lost alchemy. I'm reconnecting. Ah. See if that fixes the issue I'm having with the cargo. Hopefully. Holy cow, 18 concurrent viewers. This is the most I've ever had. At least on something that's not a Deadly Salvage premiere. Ugh. Oh. Grindy, 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 grind. Is the uh, stream, is the volume on the grind, the game sound, low enough? Or do I need to adjust some of those settings again? Because I know on a previous stream, the 
the sound of the grinders and the game sound was just absolutely deafening compared to how those of us just talking. I can barely hear it. Okay, that's perfect. Scarlet says, the former are misunderstood. Look at it from their point of view. Humans are just space cows. Well, Scarlet, I don't particularly like being called a space cow. And as Artemis would say, was that a fat joke? <laughs> oh, okay, apparently it's too quiet, the game sound. One second. Tweak that just a little bit. Is that better? Oh, someone's breathing into the mic. Hey, D, can you uh, send me an invite? Yes. There you go. Thank you. Everything about this game is buggy, even the Steam interface. Oh, yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa. Back to Gundy. I'll be back now. I'll probably be back in a minute here. Okay. Okay. I I like being able to just hear the game sound, Shadow Rifter, because uh, I feel like the grind is just deafening, especially to like headphone users and stuff. Um, I know most people end up watching this on mobile, at least according to my demographic stuff, the analytics. But, uh, I like being able to hear the people talking when I'm watching a stream. And I, I'm just assuming that you guys like that, too. Um, does the music sound okay, or do I need to bump that a little bit, too? A bit on the quiet side, but I think it's a good level. <laughs> uh, Michael Bush, we already summoned Clang a little bit. We, uh, you go back a little bit in the stream and watch. Uh, we dropped the top of the tower on the top of our rover. And there was a great clanging and gnashing of teeth. Seems the tower has a termite problem. Yeah. Nope. Moving again. Uh, thanks, Michael. Appreciate that. Oh, my energy is low. Retreat. Oh, we never finished the uh, the beds up there. I'll go up there and finish those. Did I get you went for the chair. I was going to eat. Oh, here. Are you okay? <laughs> Gotta be quick. Gotta be fast. That's the way to enter. Uh, the BB that we refer to is the BB from Aaron's Discord. Um, he uh, he hangs out a lot in our Discord. He plays with us a lot. He's not on tonight. Uh, he wasn't feeling well. Um, but he does typically join us for our Saturday survival streams. Get up here. There's a couple antennas up here. Okay, inventory full. Oops. Inventory full. Good thing we can survive, like, 10, 15 meter drops with nothing more than, like, oh, I stubbed my toe. Right. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna head up into the, the rover and finish the beds, and hopefully it'll be airtight again. Oh, you guys are already on it. Okay. Yeah, I didn't we... fix my problem. Really <laughs> that is weird. Okay, I'm just going to put it in the connector and whoever can, can drag it to the yep. park thing. Uh, well... 
the conversion goes slowly because uh, we're still gathering resources. We're going to start doing the conversion, I think, a little closer to the lake because right now uh, the rest of the gang, so we've got, there's four of us here and we're grinding down resources. The rest of them are over getting some hydrogen freighters going so they can mine the ice lake and get everything ready to load up the tanks on this that we will, I'm sure, be building very soon. Don't even know where we're gonna put the tanks. Might just put them on top, like a bunch of bunch of dorsal tanks. <laughs> yeah, Jackson, getting that farming that pirate rep. Donation detected. The Formic donated one dollar, saying. You're gonna what? need it. Thank you, the Formic, whoever you are. Unless you're actually the Formic, and then I guess he just assumes he's gonna get his dollar back after he eats us. Alright, Shadow Rifter. Thanks for, thanks for subscribing and thanks for stopping by. Uh, you get some rest, man. Can't stop painting. Yeah, I know that feeling. Unable to f figure out wh how you want to color a build. That's tough. I just see Alchemy's body just face planted into the ground right here. <laughs> Where is that? Uh, underneath the rover between the two wheels. Oh, I just disappeared. Oh, darn. I love those moments where you just walk up and there's just plop. <laughs> Yeah, Christopher, I I see that. I'm just worried about it being a little bit... Uh, I guess it shouldn't affect the center mass too much. Put it out one. That's an exterior wall. Might be able just to make the inside a little smaller there. Just line them up right there. Good place for them. We'll just... Uh, oops, I didn't empty my inventory. Herp derp. I have never seen a clang shield, Michael. Uh, what? How exactly does one build a clang shield? Someone said clang shield. I yeah, someone. The... Inventory full. Yeah, glass encouragers take a lot of uh yep a lot of silicon though Anybody excited for any games coming out soon? Um, hell, let loose has got me interested. That's the uh, that's that squad-based uh, World War Two shooter, right? Yeah. That does look interesting. I like I like a good squad shooter. Like back in the day, I used to play Left 4 Dead with my roommate, and it was. It was awesome. I mean, we, I mean, I worked second shift at the time, so literally there was like nothing for me to do. 
Um, but I was able to play like every night with him when we got got when I got off work, and so uh, we got really good. Like this is right, you know, pretty close after the game had come out, and. I loved that game. It was lots and lots and lots of fun. If you've never played Left 4 Dead or Left 4 Dead 2, it's a uh, it, it, it's a rush. It's fun to do, but we tried to play a little bit ago, and uh, you know we hadn't. This was maybe like a year ago. We just po popped into a, a versus match, and uh, we aren't we aren't good anymore. <laughs> Got absolutely wrecked. Oh, I need to go back in the. Seat up there. Your definition of good is not good enough now. Epic yeah, Duck says, a, "Oh, go ahead." I was saying, there's a similar game I used to play called America's Army. It was paid for by the U.S. Army, but like kind of like a recruiting tool. But it was a first-person shooter. Didn't that totally eventually turn based. into Arma? <clears throat> I I think Arma might have been inspired by it, but yeah, but, uh. Let's see, Epic Duck says KSP2. I am excited. I am excited conditionally because they didn't give us a whole lot of uh, gameplay, but it is still an alpha, so whatever. But, uh. But. I did like seeing that big fusion drive that they had on the back of that starship looking thing. I was excited for that. I was like, oh yeah, there we go. I'm a, I'm a sucker for hard sci-fi, you know, I grew up on Star Trek and then I started reading uh, Asimov and Clark and a bunch of stuff like that, it's just, just really cool. Scarlet says MechWarrior5, I'm right there with you bud. And then Jexum says he's excited for Gears of War 5. Uh, you know, I only played, I think, the original Gears of War and only at a friend's house because I don't... I don't own any consoles, and I never have really. I own, I mean, my parents had some when I was a kid, and they had an original Xbox. They bought a 360 after I left the house. But, uh, yeah, I've always been a PC guy. Whoa! Oh, that felt, oh. So I, I have never really played the Gears, oh. But I know it, it's it's a good co-op game. I've, I've, I did play it co-op. Gave me a uh, kind of nostalgia feelings for the original Halo. One of the funniest uh, co-op games I played with what a friend was called Army. I'm sorry, could you say that again? It was a co-op game you and a friend of mine played called Army of Two. Army of Two. Yeah, you played as a, a pair of mercenaries, you know, whoever paid you the biggest buck or whatever, and it was. Uh, Either person could draw what they call aggro, so the enemy, whoever had the highest aggro, the enemy would focus on them. So that allowed a lot of different dynamics. One person could sit there and draw while the other person others, you know, kind of snuck around. They could draw the aggro, the other person could sneak up, and made for it a very interesting. Cool. That does sound like fun. Oh yeah, the Foundation books, Greg, those are really, really good. Scarlet says Army of Two was fun, Jure. It was. Yeah, yeah my Greg. Friend, like, go ahead. Wow. Oh, whoa, whoa. <laughs> hey, you brought it down for Marvel. me. I just pulled a Waco. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, Greg, I, I really enjoyed the Foundation series by Asimov. Uh, I have the, uh, an omnibus of the, of Foundation, Foundation and Empire and Second Foundation. In uh, whoa, on my bookshelf here, here in the house of Nab and De. What were you saying, Jure? Uh, I forgot. That'll happen when somebody tries to drop a house on you. I love how this house still has power. There's batteries in the ceiling. Ok, 
Okay. While you guys finish this up, I'm going to go over here. I'm going to start uh, the retrofit. I'm going to start sticking the tanks on the side. That actually is a pretty good space for them that uh, Mr. Davis suggested. Can I make it? Oh, yeah. I'm guessing we could... Hmm... How would... What is the... We place, like, the tanks on top, but, like, they are half in the rover and half out. Well, here, there's, uh... This is what I was thinking. I'm gonna... I'm gonna fall when I do this. One second. Yeah. Placing them over there. I'm gonna stick them, um, I'm gonna kind of do a little dog leg off the side, stick them there. This is a lot harder to do without jetpacks. Excuse me. Thing. Okay, so there's a walkway there that I can't mess with. I'll have to bring them up. A level. Oh, I can't really put them here. No, this isn't gonna work. Okay, plate. Capital you for day. Oh, yeah, baby! Oh, I'm gonna leave it. Apparently, I somehow have the glamour skin selected. I'm gonna keep it, though. <laughs> I'm kind of afraid to look. Okay, so what I'm thinking... We'll just put them right on top for now. Let's see. Gee, I want. Probably have to move the turrets at some point here. Hey, the hey. yeah. What do you think about this? Uh, skin. Oh, you got the gold? Nice! Yes. Oh, yeah. we're going to do this back with the pyramid. I don't have the, uh, the deluxe version of the game. It's literally the only reason mm. the white version. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've got nine energy. I should probably go inside and get some energy. The inside is still not pre oh no it is pressurized okay good somewhere an ocean inspector just woke up with cold sweats watching de grind off that vent <laughs> yep yep all right back up here i think we already have one hydrogen tank on this thing don't we I don't recall. I thought we did. No, we don't. I thought we pulled, uh, pulled hydrogen over. Maybe we didn't. No, I just grabbed the stuff over. Gee, tank. Boom. Boom. Thing. Oops, I want six. 
So I need to go. Hmm. Hold up. Build this first one. I gotta move the second one a little bit. Paul Drive just gave me the code for the gold disco if I want it. <laughs> Here. I'm putting a hydro tank on the end of this one if you guys want to back up a little bit. Oh. Need steel plate. Did I not pull out steel plates? There we go. I like our uh, our wooden hydrogen tanks. Yeah, nothing's could go wrong with that. Absolutely not. Is the beginning of every bad plan ever. <laughs> what could happen? Okay, so there we go. There's that. We'll need to armor her up up top. We still fit right through here, right? Yes, we do. So I'll make sure we can get out. Get up here. What's left to grind down? Is it all just steel now? Is everything everything steel that's left? Uh, there's a couple little things in that brown uh, tower, but I'm. See how many steel plates we got. About ten thousand. I count about twelve. All right. Well, uh, probably just head out then. Ask for a GPS to the ice lake, and we'll drive towards them so they don't have to go as far. One of you guys wants to grab a uh, uh, connector and stick it up there, stick it up top. Oh, Alchemy's already at the wheel, apparently. Oh, there are no lights in here. Heh <laughs> Someone should probably go grind down that scaffolding that's right up against the... Oh yeah, room. probably. Yeah, let me, uh...
Uh, oh. So Matthew Burrow, who lives near me, says he just had a power outage, and hopefully the storm isn't too bad in my neck of the woods. He lives about 25 miles away from me. So hopefully we don't get a power outage, but guys, if the stream cuts off suddenly and does not resume, that's probably what happened. I'm not hearing too much wind where I'm at right now, but we'll see what happens. All right. Here. Whoa. Whoa. Did we get the, uh... Uh, my game just freaked out for a second there. That was interesting. So, uh... Yeah. We got a step back. What happened? The rover which we were using to get uh, to the city has spun out and deleted itself. I see. Well, we've got... Uh, we've got tanks put on the Scorpion, and we were about to start heading towards you guys. Would it be a better idea for us to just respawn at you? Um... Wasn't there a med bay in the city? Nope. Uh, could you, uh... Could you send us a GPS for the ice lake? Does anyone have a GPS for that? It's right next to the city. Okay... If you still have a, a city GPS, uh, I can send you it. Yeah, go ahead and send it to me because I don't think I have it. There we go. Show on HUD. Alchemy, if you want to go ahead and... Take that. 90 kilometers away. Oh boy. Well, we will get as close as we can. So the thing is, we're not going to be able to get down with this thing. Oh no? We no. can always parachute it down. <laughs> no, we're not going to parachute it down. The whole point of the hydrogen freighters was to build some small grid hydro ships, fly them to the lake, load them up, bring them up, and repeat that a few times to fill our tanks while we finish building the, uh, the retrofit. And speaking of which, I guess I can start building some of that while we move. Ah, I run out of energy. Alright, so should we move back to this channel for now? Um, could you guys get some small grid ships up and start mining and getting ice going? Uh, we are nowhere near the lake. <sighs> if the ships fly, you're near enough to the lake, right? Well, we, we were using a rover. And that thing spun out, and yeah. Yeah, that was one of the reasons I was talking about, a. Talking about flying ships is because I knew you guys are going to be far away from me and I'm the host and things happen. We're, we're on our way to the edge, but we need those small ships built. Because we don't have any way of fueling hydrogen up here. We could build them up here. But we have no fuel to fuel We have them. no fuel for them and they can't take off up here. Because the atmosphere is too thin. Well Wheels and parachutes. parachutes and kick them off the edge. If we can move my little thing, it should fly. And uh, we I could get some ice. Or maybe take resources to them so they can start a nice mining operation. Yeah, because whenever I checked with them they were going back to the old base. The, uh, Why would they go that far? The only place they have infrastructure to build anything. Yep. And they're, no, uh, they're nowhere near the city to get the resources over there. I mean, Such do you have... Engaging gameplay, holding shift and W. So are you guys heading towards the, the old base or the city right now? 
Well, we were the rover spun out whenever we were going to the city, so it so we whenever I joined in here, they were going back to the old base. Second, guys. And the city was like 15 kilometers away. Uh, you know what, guys? If we keep going in this direction, I think. Is that the ice cap? No, it's not an ice cap. Never mind. Well, it doesn't have an ice cap. Good to know. Bumpy, and then there's the edge. Yeah, we'll be coming so up. Four. We'll be coming up right. on the BF6, probably on the north side of the ice lake. So we're gonna get pretty close to that. Keep an eye out for fissures, alchemy. Whoa! Slow down, slow down, slow down. We're bumping pretty bad. Piece of scaffolding fell off. There you go. Smooths out, go ahead and resume your trek. I think they broke wheels. Yep. Oh yeah. They definitely they broke wheels. They spin out so often. Should I just tell them to come back here? I want you guys... Are there no resources back at the original base? Barely any. The, yeah, there's there's the nothing there. We've we've we essentially have had to be digging with stone to build our entire. Yep. So I vote because you, you guys can get close to the lake where we need to be, right? Except you can't. Yeah, you guys can come over. Yeah, just just come back here. Turn the turn the timer off, and then backspace teleport up here, and you guys can help retrofit the rover in route. Um. Frustrating. Base engineer strikes again. Yep, I'll head over to them. Uh, see, come on, we're dead. Okay, so you're thinking just strap on giant hydrogen engines on this thing? Uh, we'll strap we'll strap on some hydrogen engines on the side, and then we'll throw a, a, at least a light armor sheath around the top of them. Um, and then uh, we'll need some some vanilla Gatling turrets and stuff to at least be able to defend ourselves a little bit against the smaller ships. And then I don't know if we have what it takes for a jump drive. Hey, BB, how's it going? BB is now in stream chat. Hello, BB. I'm, I'm thinking of extending out this back portion where the landing pad is and turn that into like a giant maneuver build, like an engine bay. Um, that's not a terrible idea. But and it's the nice. reactor is more protected because it's like the reactor is right below me. Yeah. Yeah, we want we definitely want to protect the reactor. Okay, I'm back. Welcome back. Did you tell him to come over here? Oh. Whoa! Oh, one what just down. happened? It kind of survived, but we're going to need to... Uh... Okay, I've been kicked from the ship. Wait, what, what happened? Damage report. <laughs> I just went flying. What did we hit? I think the, I think the boarding uh, entry thing hit the ground. I mean, you need to raise your suspension probably too. Oh uh, yeah. Hey Alchemy, uh, go ahead and stop yeah, the ship. Yeah, it was definitely. Stop. Um, I'm yeah. thinking of adding a ladder. Ladders don't work too well without the jetpacks for some reason. Some mod doesn't work well. Hey, Alchemy, uh, let me let me pop in there real quick. I'm gonna check some settings. 
Yeah, we were moving. It's a uh, block of hydrogen, of hydrogen tanks with a thruster and some wheels, essentially. And then we just end the parachute, and, so, and the parachute, and then just kick it off the edge, and then drive up uh, to where we need. We're okay. Makes sense. Dude, did you, you see the size of this crater it made, though? Yeah, I do. It like destroyed the ground. Like a small grid warhead went off. All right, climb back aboard. I don't want to get moving again because we got a long way to go. All aboard. Yeah, uh, raise your uh, will height. There should be a button on. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna increase the strength too. Uh, not too much because strength uh, overrides the suspension. Just just a little bit, just to get a little bit more oomph. Uh, the when my my strength is 16, I'm gonna bring it to like 27. Yeah, and that that yeah, just good. gave. I just gave me like half a block of clearance. Are you maxed out on a uh, wheel height? Wheel height is maxed out. The problem is these are three by three wheels, not five by five. We're cruising right, along so now. What's the new plan? <laughs> so we're gonna start doing the uh, retrofit on route in route here. Um, we've got the tanks fitted. We may end up needing two more hydrogen tanks. Cause this thing, this is a big fat boy. Um, it's thick. Yes. So we might want a couple more hydrogen tanks. You wanna smack, I'm I mean, I've... What I'm is currently that? working on a uh, block of, on a, just a group of hydrogen tanks with wheels. So we can like kick it up. Whoa, this ground is chunky. I just died. Yeah, the yeah, rover's so bouncing should pretty just, good. Should I just slap another tank on the back here? Or no way. Oh my gosh. Scout. Oh my gosh. I am in Chunk City, so I'm going to sit in the bed till this is over. <laughs> this might be a longer drive than I thought, because if I go too fast, we bounce like crazy. Wonder K okay. wheel suspension. Turn off the lights now in the thing. I've got them set to propulsion override. Does that just continue to accelerate us? It seems like it's a specific one, then yeah. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Uh, does anybody mind if I just... There's this three-block uh, connector in the middle of the hydrogen tank stuff. Do, does anybody mind if I just cut that out and put in another tank? Um... Yeah, that's perfect. If we well, need another tank. Well, as, as long as we can still walk up. So the the, the upper access to the upper oh, deck... Oh, I see is that. right there. That's why, we, that's why we did that. Uh, um, yeah, you should be able to still get in there. Um, I mean, we could... There's also another access on the other side. I have side. an idea. I have, a, I have an idea. Go uh, ahead. We could branch this middle one here out to the sides and just slap two more tanks on either side. That way we can still access the top deck and uh, walk around. You no, know, I, I, I can almost guarantee we'll be able to stay. Hmm. Well, we I think down. Have, Let's try it and I we think do the problem down. is yeah, the problem is you'd have to crouch through. No, you shouldn't need to. I think you would. Well, we'll see, I guess. Uh, there's something in the way. Or no, I just don't have any components like a dummy. <laughs> All right, I got to move. Don't grind those blocks all the way off, the the name will fall off there. Uh, 
Yeah, you can walk in it up, no problem. Yeah, we're slowly accelerating. Right yeah. This is some chunky ground for sure. <laughs> Beefy, triggered by my music. Uh, the music that's playing right now is the same music I use for the intro to my perspective of Scarlet's Havelock series. Which I know, this, it's been a while since one's come out, I'm planning on getting an episode out soon. Um, where's the closest cargo access? Uh, right on the side, on the top. Uh, just kidding. I'm basically, I'm literally not touching any controls other than the space farm, just occasionally applying the brake when we start going a little too fast. Is that? I think I see the remains oh, no! of the shuttle. Help, I fell yeah. off. Yeah, look to the south, south, southeast. Alright, I'm back on, you can keep going. Hey, I fell down in the back. Bye. I'm letting it do its it's it's propulsing on its own, so the slow acceleration is intentional. That's Can funny. I do some remodeling over here, real quick? Uh, I'm where are you? Get, uh, I'm trying to get the reactor piped out. Yes. Piped out the back. Yeah, I have a pipe on top of it, and I'm trying to. See if I can remodel like where Vester Robocade is. Uh, okay, just make sure, just when you grind it down, tell everybody so we can all be secure. So we all don't right. all die and then appear back at the old base. Yeah, BB, it was doing this the entire time last, last stream we were playing. It just does this. Keen did something to the wheels, and I don't know what they did, but wheels are just the worst right now. I have to keep slowing us down. Oh, jeez. I don't like it when it starts bouncing like that. Not at all. I do not like it, Sam. I am. I do not like green eggs and ham. Alright, I'm removing this from the This when I was a kid. Such good books. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, while we're on the road trip, guys. <laughs> this reminds me of welding on the pyramid challenge. When you use the combines, they bounce a lot. Yeah. I almost want to go back to like 1.91 or something and <laughs> play without whatever changes they made to the wheels. Uh, Epic Duck, the hydrogen is for when we convert this thing to an actual ship and fly into space with it. There we go. Reactor is piped up and the straw kit is moved correctly. Okay, cool. Yeah, and, and you can go ahead and if you wanted to start building that thrust pack on the back, you're more than welcome to, crew. Yep, that was what I was doing that for. Ooh. We like hit this resonance with the little lumps on the ground. There aren't even any lumps on the ground that I can see, like invisible. But we just start bouncing and bouncing and bouncing. We've gone 30 kilometers, that's not too bad. It's so wonky because we're we're actually like going downhill. You see it? Oh it we are, feel aren't like we? It, yeah. And we're kinda of tilted a little bit too. So where are we headed to with this monstrosity? So we're gonna go to the edge of a cliff. 
Ah, okay. And then we're gonna yeet something off of there and get some ice. Okay. Um. Hey, Seekerman, how uh, how permanent are these strats on the side? Like the the, the armor I'm, block. I'm 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 fi I'm figuring out how to mount this better. Okay. Give me a bit. Sorry about the rough ride. <laughs> Uh, yeah, so... We want to take this thing to space eventually. And cut the wheels off forever. No more shall the wheels... Uh... Hey. Yeah, something like that. No more will be... will we be... forced into the tyranny of geography. <laughs> uh, um, see, Kerman, do you want any help with anything, or am I a little just, I'm a, lot, a little at a loss what to do? Ideally, we'd be able to come to a stop so that uh, I'm not getting jerked around and we can really work on this. Well, if we come to a stop, we won't be able to get to where we need to go. Yeah, so that's why I'm putting off some of the uh, oh, no. more major modification. Uh, I'm on. Okay, accelerating again. Yeah, to save to save my finger, I have the the propulsion override on, so she just drives herself. Very, very, mm -hmm. very slowly. Only take over driving so you can look around, D. Sure. So I've just been uh, whoa. Uh, I've just been tapping the space bar. If it if it starts bouncing a little bit, just really gently tap the space bar and bleed off a little bit of speed. Don't hold it because you'll you'll pitch the nose right down into the dirt. But feels like with the wooden deck and the pitching, it feels like we're actually on a ship. While it's actually oh, being worked on. Me. Yeah. Yarhar. Give her me tea. Go on there. On the other side. Very. <laughs> Dre, you like the balancing act I'm doing? Yeah. Here. Should we rename this from the Scorpion to the Bronco? The Bronco. <laughs> no, because then we're going to have to run from the police really slowly. It's not painted white. Why has it got to be white, Dre? Hospitality. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, there's another tank on here. No, BB, I don't need that kind of negativity in my life right now. He's saying he's be he's betting we're going to flip it. I have a soft I have, touch, BB. I have I have more confidence in uh, Jure's driving abilities than BB does. BB just he just wants disaster to happen. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. Is there any way I can do that? Something went clang. Lang lang. Lang a lang a ding dong. Oh. Be better than this. Yeah, we're going up a hill. Oh, well, we didn't need that anyway. It's probably not important. Uh, if you need to increase the propulsion or take the propulsion override off, you know. uh, don't because I'm going to be doing some things like that, that, 
that, that, that. There we go. Come on. I got it. All right, there are now five hydrogen tanks. Ha, ha, ha. I have to move the name to it. Yes. It is never, you can never have, the only time you have too much fuel is when you're on fire. Yes. That is true. So we're sending this Scorpion to space or something like that? Yes. Okay, it seems I missed the memo. Well, we, we might the, need to add a little bit more wheels for support. No, before we lift off, we're cutting all the wheels off this thing. <laughs> just, just to make things easier for me to build <laughs> these thrusters. Okay, this little thing. Uh, what's this for? That's Swako's. I don't know exactly what it's for, but it's not. It can't move. Not hey, for crew. now. Uh, you want me to come start? Uh, well, drat then. Uh, trying to figure out how I'm getting this up. Oh no! Oh, <laughs> oh no! Let me just fall man, off. Man overboard! I hit the brakes, Troy. There we go. Okay. Uh, G thrust. Um, Okay, I'm back we, are being we are being followed by Jordan Munzlinger. Thank you, Jordan, for subscribing. Appreciate it. Get some. You know what? Actually, armor that up a little bit. There we go. And we're going to need to connect these a little bit better than they're connected right now, but. Hey, Jocko, I have an idea. I have an idea. Yeah. Nope. Oh. Well, that's okay. gone. Okay, I don't uh, like it sound. It's okay, it's okay. Just a small bit of unfinished armor fell off. Uh, I have another idea for putting a support in on this side that does not mean we have to crouch walk through the space. How many metal grids do we have? I'm not sure. Hold on, I need uh, some steel. I checked, oh. but I can't take my hands off the wheel. Yeah, uh, I may have gotten myself stuck in the the grids. Uh, eh. At least 560. Okay, that's a problem. Probably some more lying around. Each large, uh, large yeah, hydrogen thruster takes 250. <sighs> takes a while. In total, we have 627. The hydrogen thruster should be able to lift this, right? Let's see. Sorry, I haven't been reading chat. I'm going back right now. Let's see. Well, that was a reference. He won't flip. Uh, yeah, Huaco. Yeah, no. BB Huaco's not driving because we're not jumping up into the air. <laughs> I think he'd be too tempted. Um, let's see, 300 yeah, plus ping. Yeah. Had a couple of trials, but... The. And BB says, we have believers. That's a thrust pack, that's for sure. Thank you. This ship is not going to be pretty. 
I'm trying to shape it like uh, a ship from Star Trek, but not really. Uh, Jure says his Discord crashed and won't reopen. Is this a ramp going up here? Uh, hmm. yeah, I'm gonna hop back in the driver's seat, guys, because I. It's not good if uh, if the guy driving can't hear the rest of it. Where did everyone go? Uh, they're around. Let's see, we've got... Herman's right by me. No, you can voice chat. Yeah. I don't know, I can still hear everything. Oh, yeah. uh, that's interesting. That's, uh, that's me. And I have been called a creeper before, Mr. Russian Bias. But, uh, not in reference to Minecraft. Aw, oh, man. Creeper. Aw, oh, oh, man. man. So we love you, man. Okay, so actually, no, that's what I need to grab. I need to grab my. Let's see, seven. Place some of these maneuvering thrusters on the side. Oh, yeah, I'm back. Welcome back. Managed to get Discord to obey it to behave itself. Well, what's that? I'm sure it's fine. But things, just things falling off. Don't you worry about it. I think bottom was colliding again. Probably. I never liked the sound of flying. Well, the bottom was clear. Felt like it. Oh, parkour, no. parkour. <laughs> Joker just saw me fall to my death. There we go. Yep. Then got Maybe. your body still up here. Like the back. Yeah. How do you fall to your death but your body stayed at the top? I was pinned Clang. between scaffolding and stuff. Yeah, <laughs> because Clang space is a, engineers. Is a, it's a god. <laughs> Clang demanded it. The body Hashtag game like physics. Warning. warning for the rest I of I don't us. understand how so many games just fail in, like, doing physics, because it's literally based on, like, about three laws if you don't go into quantum stuff. Sure, yeah, but, but imagine all the objects that have to be uh, have to be calculated. True. The fact that physics is hard is that you're doing that for a lot for of everything. Objects. Yeah. Like calculating. Get pretty yeah. So people but just take so shortcuts, especially in body is. physics. Yeah. Estimated the time until we get to the uh, place we need. To. Well, let me take a look uh, here. <laughs> That's nothing. So let's see where we are. So we are here. Stream. No. Nope. Nope. along. Uh, can you slow down this little second? And we have to go all the way. Well, there's some there's some lumpy terrain. Oh, I don't like that at all. No. <laughs> all the way to here. Oh, I'm starting to hear some thunder, guys. If I uh, if I lose connection, it's uh, it's been nice. Well, you might want to hit save just so we have something recent. I'll do that. It's it's distant right now. Where are you making off the back of this thing? Uh, Frost. 
<laughs> lift, I need lift. <laughs> Do we have do we have cobalt to build more? Uh, what's it called? I'm gonna start building metal grids like crazy. Yeah, I've got it pumping them. Got them pumping out. Uh oh, what are we run out of nickel. Really? It's got nickel in it. Motors. Yep. Yeah. Medical components. If you don't, uh, if we don't. To build atmosphere crossers, which would be good to take out motors. Yeah, I mean it's good to have a few, but I'm I'm slurping down a bunch of motors right now, and then I'll switch them back to uh, making the metal grids. Oh man, it's like being on the ocean, but drier and with less air. Drive off the cliff and see if you can land it. Uh, I don't think it will lift, says Russian line. Bias. Thank, thank you for the vote of confidence, Mr. Russian Bias. We really appreciate it. <laughs> what? It's definitely possible to get uh, down with parachutes. Mm. Yeah, we could get it down. That's, I'm just mm. terrified of that idea. Like, what if it flips? Oh, with parachutes? If we put them on each corner, the... should be fine, yeah, right? Yeah, won't flip. Do we want to as try that? They're... As long as they're, they're, they're amongst the highest, they don't even have to be at the corner. They just have to be like the highest thing. Eddie Magpie says, if the stream goes, I'd just like to say it's been an awesome watch. Perfect for an insomniac in the UK. Wow, yeah, you're up late, man. Or I guess early. Thanks, Eddie. Appreciate that. Um, I'm hoping it won't go. But we've only got about another hour and 15 minutes of the stream anyway. Um, stream, what do you think? Should we try to launch this thing off the edge and then float down gently under some parachutes? It would definitely work, but I don't know. Need some help, Red Spear? Yes, because I can't actually get around to, like, further forward than this, because this thing is in the way, and also the skimmer thing is in the way. Does this thing even have enough? <coughs> I'm hearing the thunder. I am going to start placing parachute blocks. I'm checking right now to see how many we need for the weight. Oh, bye, Waco. Hmm. Now, do parachutes, de do parachutes yes. deploy regardless of the Someone said goodbye. Goodbye, direction? Guys. Yes. <laughs> So I can put the I can put them face down and they'll deploy just fine. Yes. Okay. Because otherwise I won't be able to put the shoots in here. <laughs> Nav is like ah. Ooh, that. Well, that was a big flash of thunder there. Big crash of thunder. Oh man. <laughs> oh, was that through your mic? Did you hear the rumble? I thought something exploded. Well, my little ship definitely did. When I tried to go back, it was flying perfectly under this no, low oxygen. Okay, we've got two forward. What is over there? Is that a rock? And that's Joker. No, I think that's my ship. <laughs> Hello, yeah. guys. I'm running back here. Oh, my goodness. My ship was working perfectly. Until I try to. I guess the operative word there is was. Uh, I think I'll grab some power. Nope. Now all we need to do is weld this thing up. Well, Spear, the ship is gone. You may now resume your work. 
<laughs> so we're gonna start getting some rough terrain, Jeray. Let me uh, let me go ahead and scout out. I'm gonna use my <clears throat> my satellite imagery. <clears throat> Gof gof spectator comes gof gof. Highly advanced. You get to satellite imagery. <laughs> so you're able yeah, to yeah the satellite that's super far away. Uh, I mean that's basically yes. how satellites are. Yes. He's portraying himself in two before dimension it's, two. It's two all C. bumpy. It's all bumpy everywhere. It's hard to tell if we'll be able to get up and over this some of the strain. I I think we'll be fine. Just avoid the big hills. Will do. Um, the other option is you can go about go to your. Let me see where I'm facing. Go to your east southeast, and it's pretty flat up to there, but it'll be longer driving. Because this is going to get us as close to the city as possible, going straight ahead. But it's pretty bumpy, but if we turn to the left, it stays pretty flat. Alright. He has made his decision. There's something on the ground there. What is that? It's like a hole in the universe. Whatever. Uh. Let's just ignore this hole in time and space. <laughs> yes, exactly. See, Nab says there are so many strikes, so much lightning, the entire sky is lighting up every three seconds. Uh, like a regular old party. Anyone, anyone free to help me weld this up? No! Uh, come on. E no, no, no. Uh, did you, uh, I, I don't know if you said it, uh, Jure, but did you, you say down. how many we needed for, uh, how many shoots we needed? I'm just trying to find, uh, any. That thing is so bumpy and rackety. I'm like really on, on. I'm really surprised it hasn't knocked over. It is shaking I mean, my it, house. It, it... Oh. The thunder is shaking my house. <laughs> Who is driving it? Please slow down. I mean, I don't feel like. I mean, the driving's not so bumpy. At least, in, not from my perspective. Who's driving? Please, slow down! I fell off! He's slowing down. Man overboard. Man overboard. Man over... <laughs> I've been overboard and tried to... Oh um, no, Jure disconnected! No! Oh no! Oh no! Break the, break the wheels. Break uh -huh. I just knocked him out of the cockpit. You know, I was about to activate the emergency brake. Hey, hop aboard, crew. But I can't do that if you break the cockpit. I was just trying to put some engine pods. Could someone help me weld this up? Okay, do you... Well, I'm not on. I'm not on. I'm, I'm, I'm not on. I thought you were on. <laughs> I was constantly okay, that was weird. okay. I'm good. Okay. Are you... Dre, did you say you were back? Yeah, my, my PC, my, my video just totally blacked out. That's always fun. I think it reboot fast. It's funny because we have hydrogen engines on this thing now, and now it's making the hydrogen thrust sound when I push the W button. <laughs> Screw it. Was I out of the cockpit, or was I still in the cockpit? Oh, you were still in the cockpit. <laughs> I had to grind you out. Yeah, I tried hitting F to see if that would get me out, but I was like, uh, nothing's happened. So what is the big, uh... Big thing off the back of the uh, the rover here, the big tail. Is that the scorpion tail, in honor of BB? That is kind of yes.
Oh, Dre, were you able to get the, uh, get how many parachutes we need? Yeah, we should need about five. Five? Okay, I'll, I'll put six on then. <laughs> five, five will get us under 10 meters per second in uh, descent. Depending on like if the gra the, gra the gravity is similar to Earth and it's uh yeah it it's be one it's uh, one point oh at yeah ground level not cliff it's one point oh at cliff level too so it is it's so weird being yeah. on a big planet like this because this planet I made it two hundred fifty kilometers across. So the horizon is actually a lot farther away than it is than it normally is. Take some screenshots here. Can you weld this up, please. For the past half an hour, I've been trying to use scaffolding everywhere, and it's so painful. <laughs> yep. Let's see, have I ever been in forty degrees Celsius, 40 degrees Celsius before? Um, I would have to do the conversion because I'm still on old Imperial units, but I don't think I so. I think that works out to like a hundred or so. Oh, actually, yeah, I have. I have I don't been... remember American units. I use real units. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. I only, I only understand moon landing units. I'm just trying. I mean, I'm pretty sure the NASA. I'm pretty sure NASA uses metric. They do now, oh. uh, but during the moon landings, the, all the pilots have been trained in uh, ye olde Imperial system, and so that's what they used. 104 freedom units for 40 degrees Celsius. Okay, yeah, I've been Let's in 40 check. degrees Celsius weather Let's before. Check. Can you hmm? hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Okay, because uh, I. I, 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 was, I was feeling like no one could actually. Hello! Welcome to my amusement park! I'm busy with something. Uh oh. Did you. Like did you. Help. Uh. Uh, crew and Huaco, you want to give Kerman a hand with whatever he needs? Uh, Although. Yes, sir. <laughs> If we're gonna, if we're gonna fly this thing off the edge, do we need the box anymore? What do you need this, help with? This box, Mr. Term. The box I'm making. Uh huh. Is it the box you were talking about? Steve? Yeah. Okay. Um. I, so I guess not. I've got I've got four parachute hatches down. We need... I want two more amidships somewhere. I've got them oh, facing down in the corners. Because you because you said they do they do deploy upside down. Correct. Uh, I can probably put something up on top here. Hope. Are you going to take care of it or want me to take care of it? Okay, I finally set up the pods for thrust. And then go ahead and load up the parachute hatches with canvas. Yep. All we really need for thrusts is downwards and forwards. Which we can really easily do on the back entropod. Russian, there's no need for that. Nope. Nope. Oh. Okay. I got you. I got you. <laughs> Off he goes. <laughs> Ouch. I Waiting for Someone you. Someone else right, fell on. aboard. Yeah, Hawako fell off just after you got back aboard. Yeah, I'm here. Thanks. Okay. There we go. Oh, hole in space time. <laughs> uh, sorry, pardon me, Jerry. I need to get past. Yep. 
All the thrust which is really needed now can be done on the engine back once we get everything ready. Nice. We can even add a few more tanks back there if we need to. Yep. Which we probably will. Because, uh... Russian did have a good point that we we don't have a ton of fuel on this thing for how much it weighs. Put a, put a junk drive where Joko's building his little thing. We could. We can even sink it down to the floor a little bit. Attach some weapons on this thing and it should be good. Oh, space ready. Well, we're going to want to armor up the, the exterior yep. a bit too, but yeah. And we'll honestly, we can do some, some of that. We can do some of that some. on orbit, inside the gravity well, where the reavers and stuff don't spawn. Some walls are literally just catwalks. Yeah. How are we doing on our canvas loading, gentlemen? All right, canvas. Making loading. canvas right now. Uh, hold on. Ooh, 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 ooh. Just going down. Remind me, how many canvases do you need per... Uh, Five block? per. And if you can fit yeah, ten in there, fit sure. ten in, just in case we need to cut shoots and redeploy. The, I would really prefer if we added some support wheels on the back, just so like this entire back section, section doesn't fall off. Uh, no, you can't put more than five canvases in a parachute. Alright, five it is. Let's see, um, what we could do, crew, is we could throw one more... Oh, there he goes again. I'm watching <laughs> this time. <laughs> if you want to put one more parachute block at the very, very back in the middle between those two thrusters... Load it up with canvas and call it good. Hey, yep, that could definitely work. That it should it should keep the tail up. Hey Kerman, do you want to know a pretty good trick with the build plan? If he puts a pencil on the table, walk away. Oh no. Uh, Grab your welder, point towards, I don't know, a hydrogen tank, and right-click it. It will add the components you need to the build planner. And you just get over here, middle mouse click, and you have all the components to... Uh, Russian bias, this game is only available on PC. So this is on PC. PCMR. Yeah. Who is taxed with uh, loading parachute hatches? I think Red Spear was doing that. I got yeah. one over here. All right. Uh, midships and bow uh, parachutes are loaded. I've got about 30 canvas over here. So. Okay, there's one on each corner of the landing pad. I see that now. There's also one up here. Yeah. Or should I flip that over? That doesn't matter. They, right there. they deploy. They they deploy through everything. Strong unknown signal, three kilometers away. I think it's gonna smash into the ground and explode. And oh, it oh. didn't explode. It looked like it bounced to me. Yeah, good bounce. Now where's that last parachute hatch? It's up here. I see that, okay. Use the scaffolding down there. Alright, all parachute hatches are loaded. Excellent. We're ready to yeet, Captain. <laughs> <laughs> Does anyone remember how tall the cliff walls are? They're like a couple yes. meters, I think. Three kilometers, four, maybe even five, I'm not sure. They weren't that high, but they were pretty high. I think it's at least a check. A couple of kilometers at least. No, what we'll do high. is we'll 
Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, Scorpion. Whoa. This I is. Swear, this thing is like. Arrow. It's like being held together with like two pieces of tape. Yes. Well, that's the best kind of engineering. Oh, we're approaching cliff. Yep. That's it right there. It's the end of the world. Uh, could somebody build me a gyroscope, please? Maybe two. Probably two with how much this mass is. Yep. Uh, a thing in here. Gyroscope. You may need to build some motors because I was disassembling them earlier for the nickel. Putting them in, in the living quarters place. Bam, bam. Okay. Slowing down. Okay, I'm putting the parking brake on and I'm setting everything up. Shoots are all loaded, right? Should yeah, be, yes. everything's loaded. Joako uh, uh, did a double check. Okay, excellent. Yep, parking's are loaded. The parachute hatches are set to deploy at a thousand meters. I'm going to have an auto deploy on them. Jaw scopes are ready. Shoot hatches. Nine. Oh, oh wow, I am about to die. Hold on. Okay. Can someone run over and look over the edge and see if it's drivable terrain under us? Well, Actually, dude. I can I can scoot a little closer. It's used for a person, my man. I think we're by the uh, by the comm tower. Hey, Captain Rex, welcome to the stream. Yeah, they're twitchy tires, all right. If you look to our uh, west northwest, you can see where we jumped up. Yeah. Okay. Should we travel further along the cliff until we get closer to the lake? Yeah, that's what I'm going to do for a little bit. Because it's pretty drivable up here. I'm also going to be a madman. And adjust my wheel speed a little higher. Speed limit to 163. So I can actually get some speed and get away from the ledge when we... Uh, how the young people say it. Yeet off the cliff. Yo. Did you know the past tense of yeet is yo? <laughs> I thought it was yop. Or is that uh, <laughs> that, is that just Dr. Seuss? That's uh, uh, Dead Poet Society. <laughs> hey, I let my I'm, barbarian. I'm gonna check out the unknown signal. Oh, he almost got run over, crew. <laughs> Russian bias is saying uh, this thing's gonna die when we jump off the cliff. That sounds like quitter talk. <laughs> What's gonna be even funnier if you think about this is all these years our parents said if our friends jumped off a cliff, would you follow them? Yes, we're gonna be following our friends off of a cliff. We're all gonna we're die together. I mean, technically speaking, we're not following anybody. We're you're being going, taken we're along for the ride. <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm still off. No. This is going to be a bit of a. It's a bit of a decline here, but it's not too bad. Hello, strong unknown signal. What do you have for me? Captain Rex, that's exactly the idea. Ooh, there's a strong unknown not... signal. I can see it. 1.3 kilometers. Nothing. It's so Whoa, close. That's a drop. It found. I, I found nothing. It was useless. Okay. Or she could not be explosive. Uh, Epic Duck, that's why we have, if you look at the very back of that little piece of scaffolding, there's another parachute hatch right there. 
Okay, gentlemen. Wait. I'm accelerating. Am I waiting for oh. crew? No, crew, I'm way, f I'm way away from you. You're gonna have to backspace teleport. Yeah. Okay, 30 meters a second. Alert. Alert. <laughs> All personnel tapped in. Alert. Oh, no. My heart oh, is already no. starting to beat faster. <laughs> oh crap, are we accelerating to yeet? Hold on, I need to get to a chair. Yeet warp activated. Everybody prepare, down. prepare yourselves. Gentlemen, prepare your bodies. I Actually, I might go no thing. Walk I might... up, get inside and, right. and trap in. I can't because getting on a part. on a couch. We're doing this in style. We're doing so. See, thirty meters, thirty-eight meters a second. So what, like 80, 90 kilometers an hour, close to rough head math. We're <laughs> we're doing almost highway speed here in this massive rover. <laughs> Scarlet says, "Whoop whoop, pull up! Whoop whoop, pull up!" This looks like a Shaq yeah. moment, says Michael Bush. <laughs> Michael Bush. <laughs> oh no. Okay. <laughs> Ma Ma okay. Connected. Hello. Hello. Hey, Nap. Here we go, gentlemen. She picked the worst time to join. Hold on. We should have had the General Lee horn on this. <laughs> Oh, we're fine. Look at how fine we are. I'm a little concerned about our clearance. We'll be good. Maybe not. We're going to be really close. <laughs> we're going to be cruising down for a while. And I'll be able to just do this. I think. I'm still on the nose. I'll go just... I'm still <laughs> on the nose. And if someone, uh... Hmm... Still some lateral velocity, I hope? Or are we going straight yeah, down just now? Yeah, a bit. Okay. Probably should open the chute a little bit lower. I was afraid that we were gonna hit the... Hit the wall. I wanted to protect cruise engines. It would be really close. I make so up. I say grind them down to be safe. So yeah. Supplies. Yeah. Have we so actually well, got anything? There, oh. there are only uh, steel plates, though. Yeah. I, I oh, mean, we're we're moving a little bit away anything. from it, I think. <laughs> Jackson <Jeff Sim> says, <laughs> "Never go full engineer core." <laughs> Uh, I miss that series, Jackson. Engineering Core was really cool. Engineer Core. All right, should be good. Crew, you're lucky I looked before I grinded because you would have fallen. We we can stay. We're, yeah, I know, but I was about to, and I was like, oh wait, someone's there. We de we're definitely listing the one side. This probably yeah, the cargo the container. It's a cargo container. You gonna try to hit the cliff with the wheels? The plan. Let the wheels take the hit. Yay! Come on, you got this. It's fine. Yeah, we're good. We're, we're, I'm, we're all good. We're good here. I'm just gonna let the uh, shoots continue to slow us down as we go down this cliff. Yeah, <laughs> this I came out of, I came out of the uh, inventory screen to a terrifying visit. <laughs> we're currently at like a. We're like, like straight 50 down. Degree angle down <laughs> yeah. the hill. It's like, it's like 1,500 jet engines trying to like hold up a mountain off the side of a cliff. Oh my goodness. I can climb up the vertical supports. That's probably not good. 
Oh, that has got to be one of the craziest things I have done in Space Engineers. Oh my goodness. That was awesome. That was awesome. Oh, Nab's here. Should be good to clear the parachutes. Okay, yeah, I think you're I think you're right about that. Shoots. See closed. It's yeah, baby. Look at that. Super easy. Barely an inconvenience. <laughs> Mecca is concerned that we still sound sick, and that's very kind of Mecca. <laughs> we do have. A Oh, Nab just cut off. Yeah. Well, yeah. I don't know what is happening. What do you mean, what's happening? I can hear you and me. Uh huh. You keep going okay. in and out. And I keep going uh, in and out. Yeah. Well, I think you we should also have our thrusters. Because I, I definitely counted more than two last time I saw We gr We ground some of them down to avoid yeah. having them destroyed by the cliff. And it was good, too, because it was a near thing. Well, Nab should be coming through mine. I definitely heard her right there. Uh, you have to speak pretty loud. I've got your I've got your uh, noise gate set very aggressively to avoid the echo. Okay, but it's still wrong to to me because I can hear myself echoing in my ears. You have to you have to mute me. I you are. Check voice meter. See if something's coming through A one. Oh, Michael Bush. Yes, yes. That would be a, a fitting end to the stream, wouldn't it? <laughs> I, I think it's my Discord settings that suddenly changed. But I don't know which you one it is. You shouldn't have uh, anything in your Discord. Nothing should be transmitting out. Because your mic's attached to my computer. I understand that. I'm talking about the input device and output device with a voice setting. Okay. Well... I'm unable to assist you at this moment. Yeah, so the virtual audio program that we use, the virtual sound mixer thing that we use to to do all of our, our auditory magic in this, um, is less than ideal. It is, it is what is available, basically. And so we get lots of weird things, and like every time your computer turns off, voice meter swaps out a bunch of things, and it's just... It's a little frustrating, but uh, it lets us do stuff like this. So, but stream, you haven't been getting too many echo moments, have you? I've been sounding fairly normal this whole time. Good night, BB. Yeah, you seem to have been sounding sounding good. Yeah. Guys, I see the lake. Hey, remember how last week I was saying I don't want to take the rover to the lake because it's too dangerous? You guys yeah. can. You, yeah. you guys may not laugh at me. Uh, uh, the last time I was driving here, I was being ferried on one of BB's hovercraft. Yeah, this section of the planet hasn't been too kind to our vehicles. No, it has not. Oh, that was a big chunk right there. And... Oop. Oop. We jumped off that cliff. Oh my gosh, we jumped off that cliff. Uh. Yeah, sorry the stream hasn't been a little bit more exciting, except for that one moment of sheer terror leaping off a cliff. But, uh... I've been having fun. Hope you guys have been too. Michael Bush has zero sound issues. Thank you so much for telling me that. That's, uh... Woo! That's a first! That's, that's very important to us. Avoid the trees... Communication is key. Communications break down. I can't sing any more than that because YouTube would be like, copy strike. Fifty meters a second. I'm gonna slow us down a little bit here. Do we have any uh, oxygen, hydrogen generator? I don't know if we have them yet. Go ahead, slap no, some down oxygen. somewhere. I think there was one, but it's probably not. Right, oh, no, one at a time, guys. 
Nobody at all. No, no one is stupid. Here, I will go into the... We have no O2 generators. I know our place where we can place one. Yeah, we're gonna need several to fill these tanks up uh, quickly. Before you build too much off the back there, crew, we're gonna need some counterweights off the front. Otherwise, this thing's gonna tip up. Yep, I can easily just do that. Or add more wheels. Well, I'm thinking that once we get to the lake, um, I, I might drive across the lake and get to the shore by the city. Um, and then we will stop. I'll lift the wheels up as high as they go. So I'm going to place a landing gear on a stick. And then I'll lower the wheels so the landing gear locks. And we'll cut all the wheels off and begin converting this thing into a ship. And if anyone presses P, so help me. <laughs> I will give you a special role on the Discord. And then we will yell how I assume. Uh Michael Bush says, Can I send my Terminator 2 HK tank after you? Did I see that on the workshop? I may have seen that on the workshop if you put it on the workshop. Um No you can't because this game will not allow you to join because it's full. Mwahahaha. Nab, you still working on those sound issues? There we go, okay. now it's a little bit more balanced. Shades of Narwhalicorn. It looks more and more like a ship, though. It does, though. Like, 50% of it hey, is... Okay. Narwhalicorn was much more elegant than this monstrosity. What do you mean? This it's thing has fighting. character. <laughs> One second, uh... And so, once we get out on the ice, I'll, uh, I'll turn the... Hey, that's where we mined ice for the big carrier thing that we left up on the... on the shore there. Alright, uh, just so everybody knows, we do have a passageway along the port side of the boat. The boat rover. Uh, I just cut a hole through. No, okay. I mean, Dre, you can go onto the catwalk like this. Okay. Uh, would somebody mind uh, taking the wheel from me? Okay. Let me know when you're ready. I'll slow down a little bit. Let me know. Shall we get a rotor piston mining machine? DEM here. Okay, there you go. It's all yours. We're extracting lots of bikes. Okay, Nab, you wanted to speak to me? I think we can extend the bridge up a bit. Okay, one second, guys. I will be right back. You're going to hear some futzing around in the background, so I will, you can enjoy the beautiful views of the approaching city. Never mind, I'm good. Uh, let's try not to temp clang. Walk up. Not Aww, yet. Okay. At least. Not, not yet. yet. Not yet. Uh, don't fall. Okay, I fell good. Hey, Dry. How yeah. are you? I'm good. Okay, I'm back. Discord is being really weird for Nab. She's She can actually hear me speaking through Discord. But I'm muted. So I don't know what that's about. Hmm. 
Captain Rex says, I think by helicarrier can pick you guys up. Probably. We actually did pick this thing up with what was left of a helicarrier at one point. I can't small ships have ladders. Um... Because Keen said that they couldn't. Obviously. We'll get up to the shore and then we'll just uh, set up a piston drilling set up for ice and just suck up a whole yeah. mess of ice. I'm trying to expand the bridge. That rumble you just heard, if it did get through, uh, was the kaboom of thunder. Thunder. We've been thunderstruck. Hey, look, it's that city place that we were at forever. I think, do I see hydrogen engines? I think I do. On the back of one of those wrecks. That'll be good. Uh, it's probably too late to fix it, but it really bothers me that the uh, hydrogen tanks along the top of the ship uh, don't line up with our cargo ports. They line up with the forward cargo port. Eh, sort of. I mean, they're one off, and then somebody put on two more hydrogen tanks, and now I want them to be... Uh, this, there's not much to these. You could probably break them. And, I know, uh, I'm just saying. I'm just saying it's annoying that they don't Or you could just... Sup. Okay, can you still hear me through his microphone? We can hear you. Yeah. I can hear you anyway. Okay, good. Next, I just had to restart the entirety of Discord, and I'm not certain what the heck okay. it was doing. Um, what are you What are you planning to do to connect? Because that's where the hydrogen tanks connect. I mean, I've got uh, I've got another connection up at the back there. Oh, okay. I hooked it up underneath the scaffolding. So it should, I'm going to double check, but it should still connect. Are we still on the ice a little bit? Nope, we're off the ice. Okay. Just barely, though. I was thinking we could actually move back onto the ice a little bit, set up a piston drill, set up, and just start sucking up ice. But we don't necessarily have to do that right this second. I think I can I do this. I haven't my little flying machine. Oh, oh dear. Ah. What? What happened? Oh, I just fell through a hole where that parachute block used to be. And... Oh yeah, I probably should have mentioned that I did something to it, but I didn't. Because <laughs> I'm a bad person. That's fair. This is a family show. <laughs> it's a family show. Oh, it's it's more of a family show now that I'm here. Oh, Nabri and Waco are hand mining like bosses. Here, let's back this. I'm gonna back this thing up, and so they can uh, not run so far. Hey, guess what? Hey, guess what? Hey, guess what? Hey, guess what? I'm here, and the nab cam isn't. Oh, let me fix that. One moment. So yeah, I thought I was gonna die, you guys, on the way home. You need to turn on your NDI. Ah, <sighs> stupid. Your OBS isn't even open. Nope, I thought that you had already done that, because you usually do when you start streaming. I wasn't sure if you were going to get back in time. Oh. Ah! Something, oh, something just exploded. They went directly to the hole, and something just exploded. Oh, you, you, you literally went right into the hole. Stop driving for, for, right. for Yeah, put put the parking brake on right here. Right. There you go. Nab cam if you want is... to, you could add a conveyor pipe going straight in the middle of those thrusters and then have a piston going down with a drill. Yeah, I was thinking of doing something like that. Just to because get the ice faster. Between those frosters. You guys changed the, everything. Yes, we did. Does the hydrogen ship have an oxygen generator? 
Mm. Because if it does, you can start transferring some ice to We all need to build one Chip somewhere. has been disconnected from terminal. Wait, what? What? I don't know. He might be too far. Yeah, he might be just a little bit too far. Build the block. Who has supplies? Um, I'm gonna get some. <laughs> You must build it. You must construct additional pylons. If you build it, they will come. Yes. Something, something... Dark side. Ease his pain. What? What is pain? Who's pain? Who's pain, you? Ha 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 ha. Oh yeah, Rex, you hadn't seen those yet. Disco tires. So I'm gonna build some scaffolding, and I'm gonna grab... a. Drill here. Five. Boop. Boop 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 we're not, we'll, hopefully we'll not be going forward. Hopefully this is where this is going to stay. <laughs> hopefully we go lifts. up. <laughs> yeah, up is the direction we want to go after this. Well, in case you go forwards, I just place blocks over the hole, almost at the level of the ice, so... Okay, yeah. cool, cool. That will work. By the way, as the female half of Ball and Chain Gaming, I want to officially say hello to all of the new people who have never watched us live before. It is good to see you all. We're still overwhelmed and excited. Uh, good to talk to new people, good to see you around, and hope you enjoy the rest of our content. Well, I know I don't enjoy our content at all. I hate our content, it's the worst. I don't understand why anyone likes us. It's because you hate your own content. But oh, that, we yes. Don't you. <laughs> <laughs> Reverse like, psychology like, right there. Reverse marketing or something like that? <laughs> <laughs> Just make something we'll hate. That means that means everybody else has good taste. <laughs> Maybe the place pissed. Okay. Just gonna stand right under here. We have bad taste, but we make good stuff. <laughs> wow, you pushed me away. Sorry, I was just sorry. trying to put stuff. Sorry. You're so mean. You're so mean to me. Fix. Oh, no. Yes. <laughs> For some reason, okay, it feels so like Nab's mic is like. So much crisper than these, but these is just like it feels more like kind of real. What? What? <laughs> it, it feels so weird. You know they're on the same mic. Well, well, no, no we're, we're not. On two separate mics. Two separate mics going through the same feed. Yeah. It's complicated. It is complicated. Which is why we always have sound issues. Yes. Uh, her mic is does sound a little warmer than mine. Because my voice is just naturally warmer it's than so yours. So warm. Wait, we're not fans. Ready? I'm a I'm a woman on the internet. No, well, you're not. You're a man. Oh, well, sorry. You're only men on the internet. I'm sorry. That's what uh, I learned when I, I was a kid. Oh, what was it that I did? La I am man. Uh. <laughs> I don't. I don't think. Actually, I think I'm still man. I think I'm still a guy. I haven't been able to change back into the female. You need to change back. <laughs> darn, darn deadly salvage. Making me be a man. I need a series of tubes. Do we not have any large steel tubes it's, left? It's a series of tubes. Um, I think we should. I did use a bunch a for making tubes. these hydrogen tanks, but I don't think they should have used of all of them. Alright, so four generators are online, and we can move them later if we want them somewhere else. Okay. 
Matt, we do know that the nab cam is off center. Yes, we do. It's usually in uh, no. the, in the up look, look most at your corner. OBS window. Oh, that! That's because of Minecraft. That's what you mean. I was confused. What the? What the heck? It's because of Minecraft. Don't worry about it. Minecraft had to be changed. OBS when I was streaming to Nab Nights. Huh. Because it didn't go full screen. Like, I had to... This was the the scene that I was using for Minecraft. So. Why do people like that game? Ah, uh, yeah. Thank you, by the way, Matt. I didn't understand. I was confused. <laughs> that um, says, do not blame Minecraft. Minecraft for life. Well, it was Minecraft's fault. I'm just saying. Epic Duck 43 says, didn't know sound has temperature. Well, you know, we learn something every day. Uh, it's just that that's how I've heard it referred to before, and so I, I use it. Yes, the warmth of somebody's voice. I'm sure that isn't. Okay, can I fit a drill here now? Huh. I guess we actually are out of large steel tubes. Um, Don't worry, I'm making more. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we're gonna have to drill around the hole a little bit here. I'll drill while you guys want to pick up the slice. By the way, Matt, that is terrifying. Yeah, like, I I was in the chat earlier on, like, going to make my way home and was like, I'm freaking out because the lightning storm and thunderstorm was just crazy and there were strikes happening. I lived in Florida for a while and they have lightning storms, like, every, every day at 3 p.m. Um, during the summer and so I've been in crazy thunderstorms. They have strikes all the time, but I am not used to it where I live now, and it was very strange. Kind of terrifying. Scary stuff. Had a lightning bolt fly over my head and strike a building nearby. I felt every hair on my body stand up. It was the weirdest feeling. Petrifying. Yeah, well, it was yeah. terrifying. <laughs> Like, as a kid, I was like, thunderstorms are the coolest things, and I still love the sound of them, but I gained a respect for the, no. the terror that it can create. I just realized we probably shouldn't drill down, because the lake is not that deep. We should drill sideways. I am drilling sideways. No, I mean with the piston I'm about to build. The piston that I did build. I'm going we to now tear down. to do... Uh... I uh, know. Oh, we can just put the uh, we, drill right where that did, and then just back up. Let's take the lake with us. Yes, let's scoop it all up. Yeah, it'll be fine. <laughs> what the heck was that? <laughs> <laughs> what on the earth? <laughs> <laughs> That was a noise I just heard. <laughs> That's on stream forever now. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's not let's not have a contest to see who can make the most disgusting sound into their microphones. Yes. And honestly, DE will win if we have that uh, contest. No, not down. <laughs> not down, Waco. This is a family show. A family <laughs> show. What anyone like a banana? I changed the thumbnail to like banana gins, by the way, in case nobody saw that I changed the thumbnail to it. Nobody watches old videos. Oh, on but it's on. It's on our channel. It's on the like. It's one of the playlists that's featured, and it's the video. It's on the main page. So. So you can still see it. <laughs> That was a nice try. You failed, but it was a good try. So we're gonna have to go deeper. I'm missing the motor. <laughs> that noise, wow. <laughs> Matt says, imagine being 
uh, one of those people who gets struck by lightning more than once in their life. Yeah, I can't. Like... I choose to not imagine that. Okay, so guys, we're gonna build the pistol off the pistol, the piston <laughs> off the back. America. <laughs> America. I want to have words with whoever else did top armor for the the ship because it doesn't. It doesn't exist. <laughs> uh, it gets here on Tuesday. <laughs> Bonus points if you know the movie. Wah! Keep seeing rainbows run past me. <laughs> <laughs> Rainbow! Family show. If, the, if you just said what I think you said. Rainbows? Rainbows? No, the other one. Rainbows. The uh, oh, you did. Uh, you said you said freak again without really pronouncing the R. Now, oh, you do well, that I, all the time. I said I, I thought I just said wah. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe. I don't think I said freak there, there at all. A, there was an F sound in front of that. I, um, okay. All right. Uh, by the way, either um, way, I didn't actually say anything naughty, so whatever. Sorry, you heard that. Whatever it was you heard, but I didn't say um, anything naughty. So, hey, quick question. So, hey, since what? To, uh, since I'm gonna need to build one anyway, where's a good spot for me to put a bed? Uh, I think we actually have a couple unclaimed beds. Yes, we do. Yeah, one, two yeah. unclaimed okay, beds never mind. On, the, on the port We're side. Good. I'm going to go and continue greebling then. Um, by the way, <laughs> I'm, I, I am glad that you could finally get into the stream. <laughs> yes, it has been an ordeal for, uh, for Red, Red Spear to try yeah. and get in. <laughs> yes, because uh, everyone else is the fastest keys in the West. Are you guys yes. you're not too drillers? We're, we're losing uh, ice. Yeah, I mean, don't okay. expect this to be a regular occurrence. Because <laughs> I doubt my luck is that good, but you know, whatever. <laughs> well, it's been fun playing with you. Yeah. And anyone else who wonders how you can be a part of one of these streams, join our Discord and be around on Saturday afternoon or evening. And uh, you will be able to see uh, in our Saturday Survival channel, I will ask for who's interested. And we always keep at least two slots open for non-patrons. If you're a patron, you do get first right of first refusal. But uh, there are always at least two slots open for everybody else. So, and it's just first come, first serve. Mm, although it might change depending on a couple of different it, factors. We but. were talking about going to uh, Deadly Salvage trivia. <laughs> are you a true fan? Can you truly prove your worth? Why did I use my big and. Um... Well, it's not mouth because I'm typing, so... <laughs> Why did I use my big hand, so it's a chest? Yes. One of the perks of being a patron is being able to say before anybody else gets a chance, yes, guys, I will be part of it. Say I've what? been, I've been, well, people are mining without picking up, and so... Well, yeah, I, I don't care about the ice, I'm trying to place the drill that's going to get us infinitely more ice than that. That's why I'm drilling over here. I am not a fan of the sound of these boots on the ice. The yeah, it's just it's the yuckiest noise. Not the quite yuckiest. the yuckiest. It's just, I don't like it. Well, it doesn't like you either. Well, that's fine. It doesn't have to like me. We'll just hate on each other. It'll be fine. Yeah, Mutual there we feeling go. of dislike. Drill. Okay, drill is placed. Well up drill. Yes, comrade. <laughs> <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to another Saturday survival. 
try to build. I need four I more filters. <laughs> Four more steel tubes, sir. I got the steel tubes. Okay, drill is being activated. Stand back. Or stand I'm using on the science. Drill. All right, somebody beat me to it. Yeah, it was buddy. me. I made it slower so it doesn't clang. Excellent. Better safe than clang. <laughs> This will also allow for more pistons to be placed. More pistons. Uh, it's, it's, more... Not, it's, it's not more pistons. It's, uh, you drill this, you retract it, you grind off the piston and the drill, and then you place three conveyor blocks, replace piston and drill. Continue. But... <laughs> Michael Bush says you need a rotor with that piston to complete the madness. Oh, and Captain Rex says don't need piston, just drive in reverse. That's, that's a fair, <laughs> yeah, that's that's a fair point. Hey, just, uh... Reversing piston. Let me see how much ice we've got on Yeah, board. but the, if we, like, just cut the drill and place two pistons more, because that's more or less the space we have, or two pistons more and the drill, we get further out, and with each generation we can get two pistons more per piston. So, yeah, Hang it's on. gonna... Retract the piston. Leave the drill running. It's already retracting. Okay. Oh, by the way, if you are new and you are... I noticed somebody earlier was saying they were binging to catch up. If you are doing that and you find hilarious moments in your in your watching, please make a timestamp and put it in the comments and and explain what the what the little thing is so that I can make a compilation of funniest moments. Um, oh yeah, Saturday's on survival. the uh, on Saturday survival. Yes. Oh, oh, no. oh no! Stop! 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 He's broken. It's okay. Grind the grind the piston off, and just put the drill directly on that block. Oh, we It'll need be these. a lot stronger. That was really funny. Captain Rex called it. <laughs> yeah, the square clank. T minus ten seconds. Yep. Yeah, just oop. Yeah, just go ahead and place the uh, the block directly on that conveyor we're, we're, we're digging our own oil pit here uh, so are we expecting that this, uh, this thruster this thruster cluster is permanent ish or in, in a good uh, enough it's probably, iteration that... all right I mean, i'm gonna start it, it, welding it, it then yeah that that's gonna be there we may actually end up uh Drill two off. You may go backward. Yep, working on it. The really son. Hello, Mr. Cherry. Be aware, you may get drilled if you get if you get. This is working better than it should. <laughs> the ship's it's bewitched. Working. Space engineers sliding. Stop locking me out of the door. <laughs> just nah, you doing okay yeah, no, no, it we're won't we're let me we're... out. Oh, it's because the other door's open. No, it's not. It is closed. Well, it just um, doesn't like you. So, since we're down here, can we remove this freighter rover, the small one that's blocking the entire? Yeah, we can get rid of it. Flight? Okay. Oh my gosh. I feel bad because Kermit spent a long time on that. Um, there are also... Uh... It's done. Let me just like launch it off. It's Right now it's charging up its hydrogen tanks. It, it only needs okay. its eyes and it can go away. Actually, if, if you launch it can, it, can it carry a fair amount of cargo? Oh, it's if a rover. Cargo ah. containers on it, yes. Yeah, um, you can go over. If you can start grabbing hydrogen thrusters... And stuff from the wreck. You see the wrecks in front of us, from where the Formic shot down a whole bunch of ships. There used to be a spaceport where this, uh, at least according to what we heard, where those craters are. There used to be a spaceport there. 
they bombed it. But there's some crashed ships nearby that have a fair amount of resources, and we're going to need those grids for all of these uh, all of these thrusters. This thing looks like, <laughs> for the life of me, it looks like I've got an outboard motor off the back of the boat, and it's just going in reverse. Fifteen minute warning. Yep, 15 minutes. 14 now. Well, more like 20 because we started about five minutes late. <gasps> Why? Why do you think? Because sound. Yes. Yeah. I love this perfectly straight, like, it pleases me, this perfectly straight line we're dr drilling <laughs> in, the, in the ice of the lake. Hydrogen thrusters. Hmm. Okay, ah! we have lots of ice. The fine we should lots. have about a hundred k about now. Okay, we're still gonna need more. You see all the tanks that we yeah, gotta fill I up. Know. This is <laughs> this is going to take a lot. Ah, crap. That sounded good. Uh, no, I just fell off the... I fell off the back. You didn't hit the drill, did you? No. That would've been bad. I fell yeah, off this... the side. Okay, that's not too bad. So... This stream has actually gone really well. We drove yeah. off a cliff today. Ta-da! It's amazing. Magic. Ace is amazing. What? <laughs> what sorcery is this? Ah, uh, there's something relaxing and satisfying about drilling a perfectly straight line in the middle hey, of an ice lake. Stop, 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 stop. The uh, drill is getting full. It's almost getting full, the drill. drill. We must be uh, full up on cargo everywhere. Yeah, oh, yeah, that's what I was saying. We have lots of ice. Let's uh, slap down some some more gens. It's the best idea I've heard all. Okay. I don't want to burn them in here because Scarlet will be upset. Should I put this one? All right. Da, 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 da. All right. So the the observation deck slash bridge is pretty much ready. All needs now is to be set up and for the cockpit to be removed. Okay. I just realized that I left the parking brake off. So I'm going to go ahead and fix that before something horrible happens. Okay, so you know how it's the little things that make you happy? Yes. As I- this has always made me happy. As I run through the grass, right? Flowers pop up. They just pop. Because they weren't there before, they just pop out of the ground. I just think it's kind of funny. And then if I run back this way, they pop back up. And then as I get closer to the beach, Every once in a while, a blade of grass will be like, Oh, no, I belong here too, and we'll pop. <laughs> it's just funny. I think the graphics are hilarious. Alright, time to do some exterior work. Everybody's gonna notice it. I can't hear you, what? Never mind, it's fine. I'll just have to listen to the stream and find out what you're making fun of me for. I wasn't making fun of you at all. It's obviously me, because you weren't talking to me. <laughs> We can't hear each other even though we're right next to each other. Because we have each other muted. So oh, we, can't, go, 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 go. we can't hear each other echo if we're muted. Tired. Rotors and pistons making grids wiggle. Oh, those are the wheels. I guess they're a type of rotor. Okay, now we have an O2 generator on the bridge also. We could even okay. add a vent. 
So the bridge has its, its own separate. Okay. Yeah, Alright, I brought four, back a hydrogen seven, thruster. Eight. We have eight O2 gens filling our tanks. All the thrusters are off, right? Yeah, yeah I turned them all off. Tanks. How fast are they filling? And we're at 7.1% already. It's not too bad. Good night, Eddie. Good night, Eddie. Yep, we uh, we do this same time every Saturday night. I know it's uh, not necessarily convenient for those of you in the UK or Europe, uh, and it's just the only time we have available to do this. Because we've got three kids under f six years old. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! What's your gosh? The what? The it's uh the flying flaming monstrosity that is uh, Kerman's hydrogen tank rover. Matt, what nice. is All right, awesome. So that's a thing now. All right, uh, bridge is sealed. Looks like. I'm gonna come over there and take a look at the stuff you guys been doing. The paint doesn't match. Yeah, at all. This thing needs to be repainted. Desperately. Priorities. It's not too bad. You got your observation observation door, and up there is your pilot door. Okay, everyone. And this is where you sit to get killed by the going. reapers. This isn't where you're supposed to, like, uh, in combat fly, but this is where you can just look around. You know, be able to see stuff while you're driving. You know you're what? Driving. It, uh, it actually reminds me quite a bit of Special Delivery, which... Brings a Aww. tear to my eye. Poor special delivery. Yeah, I'm gonna take control of the entire ship so I can paint everything in wood color. I like wood. Hey, Will do you we want to put another? Whoa, 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 whoa! One at a time, guys. Sorry. You first. You. Walk, walk us hard. Speaking second. Okay. Uh, do we want to put another? large uh, hydrogen thruster on the very front of this enormous row of uh, of um, do or do we want to leave it not um, like that I don't know exactly what this thing's going to turn into at this point um, we've got two forward like Breaking thrust. Uh, yeah, and I'm hydrogen. like, I don't know if we'll ever land again once we get into space. So once we get into space, we may rearrange some of the lift thrusters into other other configurations. Yep. Okay. Definitely. <laughs> I will leave it for now. I saw that, Dad. Uh, <laughs> what happened? Yeah. <coughs> Nothing. Mm-hmm. I just am failing, and then as as I'm failing, my man uh, is <laughs> making me laugh. <laughs> there we go. We've got wood up here. We got wood. wood. Hey, how do I take a look at what my build planner is? Uh, you press, you press, uh, you go to G, and it's in the lower right hand corner of the G menu. Ah, okay, cool, cool. Mr. D, yeah, the I saw. grill is ready for you. Grabbing some more ice. As long as you don't start playing Ice Ice Baby. No, I will never play that song. Uh, Dre, when you come back for the the large thrusters, I have made a, a way to them from the. Oh, wait. 
Yeah. And we could even put like a fly through hanger right there with the uh, like uh, off to the left port side have a hangar doors opening there and put a small ship in there like a miner or something. I'm thinking we build some uh, some broadside and uh, ventricle. I guess we got, we got a decent amount of armor eventually, but some port and starboard armor plates. The you know my usual spaced special DE armor, held on by you know three or four pieces, and then it has a whole bunch of a uh, bunch of armor. Just to stop things from hitting whoa, the good parts. Whoa. It's okay. It's a boat on water. It's supposed to do that. Hey D, you, we are full. We are full again. Okay. Base is That's full again. That's what's happening. Great. Oh. Okay. I might just, I might just reduce the uh, count of players to one. And let this thing run for an hour or two tomorrow or something to burn through some of this ice. Because that's the last thing I no, think people want to watch. No, it burns pretty fast. Should probably add nation gens on the other side. Chewing up a bunch of it. We need a few more things yeah. while we do about this, and possibly replace some of the uh, hydrogen tanks with uh, large cargoes. Yeah, one second. Uh, Captain Rex, uh, we would really appreciate that, but like I said, as long as you're in our Discord, if you manage to be faster than Huaco and crew, there's always a chance for you to get on board and yeah. do one of these streams. <laughs> That's a big <laughs> if. That is a big if. <laughs> That's a very big if. <laughs> but thank you for the sentiment. Yes. If you would like, that. if you'd like to become a patron, um, there are quite a few fun rewards. So. And there, are, the link is in the description if you'd like to review those. But yes. thank you so much for watching. Have a good night, man. The best is the banana voice. <laughs> <laughs> Which we need to put out. Shoot. Oh crap. Oh. I forgot it was the first Saturday. Don't worry. Too It'll late. be out tomorrow. <laughs> It'll be out tomorrow, just a day late. But yeah. Every week, a certainty of Patreon get to hear me use this banana voice to read something. It's usually quite amusing. <laughs> That's a nice hydrogen thruster you've got there, Red Spear. Um, okay. <laughs> <laughs> now you all know how alchemy felt I'm in sorry, bananigans. I'm too, I'm too sick for this. I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. uh, I, I was psychically given your plague. Uh, that's unfortunate. Nobody needs our plague. <laughs> so did alchemy tell you he was going to fall asleep on his keyboard, or did he fall asleep on his keyboard again? Um... He, he's he's he, still he, here. Well, I, yes, but he's AFK everywhere. Like he, I'm pretty sure he fell asleep again. <laughs> <laughs> Alchemy has a rough work schedule and passes out a lot. Um, yeah. Oh, hey, Michael Bush joined our Discord. Hooray! So, welcome to the Discord. I don't know if, if I don't know. I don't think any of our. <laughs> Moderators are online. Uh, I we'll think, take care yeah, of your roles and stuff in a second after the stream. Are. I think that Scarlet was on. I can. I'll just hop off. Okay. We need to end anyway. Very soon, yes. All right. Roles are given. Welcome to the militia, Michael. All right. So I'm gonna go ahead and say everybody finish up whatever task you're doing right now, and then report to the bedroom. Okay. Do you like the five hydrogen thrusters for a forward thrust? I do. It means we can run away fast. Exactly. Although uh, some reavers have grab drives. Hey, you think uh, replacing I saw the that. engine pods on the, on the sides with like hangar base would be good? 
Um, I don't think the ship needs to be too huge. I think what we need is, uh, we'll need armor after we get this thing lift worthy. I'm just I giving a nice cinematic shot of energy. it right now. Better sit down somewhere. You're gonna hurt yourself. Or, or, yeah. or better yet, climb into bed. Yeah, actually, yep. you know, like I said, it's 10:31. Uh, got a couple minutes here. Everybody, finish up what you're doing right now, and then hop into the bed. I am running. I need the bed. I need to find one. I uh, there are right two blanks. The there are two blanks, and we have two new people, so it'll work out. Ta -da! I need a nifty name for mine. Uh, how about nifty name? Sure. That works. I think it's nifty. It even says so. Why does this say secondary bed for DE? I don't know. <laughs> Waco just asked the same thing. You know, if we really need cargo, uh, a cargo carrier, yeah, I have yeah. a... Uh... Mine's perfect. Yeah, uh, reference photos because we're not allowed to do pretend reference <laughs> photos. <laughs> okay, okay, Seriously, I, I went and sliced it into chunks uh, where all the parts are visible and took uh, like reference uh, three six reference photos and everything. That's hilarious. Nice. <laughs> Thank you for for cooperating. You know where alchemy is? He's standing in Scarlet's chamber. <laughs> <laughs> Super in his creepy. Suit. Uh, that's funny. Just leave him back. Leave him there. He's 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 sleeping, standing up. Okay, guys, we uh, we have hit hit that time. So everybody, pop off into your beds. Navarin yep. is probably running somewhere. No, I'm trying to <sighs> trying to get off of a hydrogen thruster right now. There we go. But uh, thank you, everybody, for watching. Um, oh my goodness. <laughs> yeah. That would be a good idea for you, Mike. Uh, we are uh, we're gonna call it here, guys. This was a great stream. I am I'm really excited about how well this went. Um, I feel like that we had lots of good things. Uh, we accomplished our goal of getting down here. The rover's not quite fitted for space yet, but we got a whole bunch of ice on board, and we didn't die driving off the side of a cliff. Okay, so that's that's a thing, and we're definitely gonna have to update this blueprint here because the rover doesn't look anything like that anymore but Yay. yeah so thanks everybody for watching uh if you liked it please hit that like button and uh if you didn't let, leave us a comment and let us know why and of course there's always a dislike button if you didn't like it um which somebody has taken advantage of already yes yes i have a very good idea of who it was <laughs> uh but <laughs> thanks all you guys in stream for watching we appreciate the uh we appreciate the time you take to hang out here with us and we always like hanging out with people who like our content um john and, you're welcome you're welcome and, and you can even become part of the content yes please please join our discord hang out with us we we are we are very all about active in interacting our with our community yeah but thank you all again and i will catch all of you next week on saturday survival good night guys